Hey y'all, so I wanna show you something that I just did. I thought it might be helpful for some of you out there. And also, I don't know if I'm like the only one, but I really get sick of eating like sweet things and um, breakfasty sweet things. I'm not really big into like pancakes and waffles and all that sugary stuff. Um, and ever since we made our lifestyle change two years ago into, um, we went from keto to paleo. It's basically what we do, it's more keto. Um, the only difference is, is we don't use sweeteners. I'll show you, so if you're looking for something or a go-to that you may have these ingredients, it's super fast to make, it's filled with protein and fiber, and it's delicious. So what I used was some leftover quinoa and some lentils, a beef steak tomato, cucumber, all organic vegetables, some lemon and regular sweet basil growing in pots on my front porch, and I also added apple cider vinegar, Italian herbs that I dehydrated, salt, pepper, what else? Oh, and so when I cooked my quinoa last night, I threw a clove of minced garlic in there and that just added another level of flavor. Cut a cheese, I think it was like maybe one or two tablespoons. Mixed it all up and look at that. High protein, fiber filled, delicious. Yeah, this is it. I will be so full um, from all the protein and fiber. The quinoa is really good at providing satiation so I'm, I'm satisfied and then I've got all the vegetables and it, the apple cider vinegar is good for your gut and like just so many wonderful things and so I thought maybe y'all could make something like this it's really easy um, it's delicious and uh, yeah I don't know I just felt like sharing that with you because I feel like there's so many things out there that we could easily run to to make like good for us so this is easy too and it tastes great and it's good for your body have a great day so go make it okay okay enjoy